Here I've created a sound wave with a higher frequency, 200 Hz. As you can see, it barely works, if at all. The same with this lower frequency, 100 Hz. The closer you are to the resonant frequency, the better it works. Now for a smoke test. I first tape the system to keep it from moving. And then I light an incense stick and put it in the bottle, trying hard not to have it touch inside. Before I turn on the sound, the smoke comes out gently. But when the sound is on, there's a jet of smoke coming out. I don't have any way of seeing it, given the high frequency, but of course... ...activity here is obstructed by this bit of paper. It's invisible to the sound, so the sound waves travel from the speakers uh, along the tube and then exit and you can hear it. Now if I unblock the silencer, amplitude of sound in decibels uh, against the frequency of sound in hertz. We can see that on this, uh, on this region the sound is clearly reduced and uh, it's right at the, at the, at the location of this, uh, of this peak here which represents the whistle that we're trying to attenuate.